Howdy folks, welcome back to more Lemmings World Tour. We are uh, continuing the final rank today, the groupie rank. We've had some pretty awesome levels thus far. I'm hoping they're going to be continue to be this cool. Yes, we finished five levels, so we are now a... No, not a... Pfft, already. That's an eighth of the way through the rank, not a quarter. <laughs> not a math major. <laughs> We're on level six. Stacks and stones. Oh, great. Two of my least favorite... Actually, no. The disarmer is my least favorite skill, but... Stackers and stoners are also kind of up there. 40 lemmings, we can kill up to two. I'm not having a good math day, folks. I almost said two. We can kill four of them. This is by the Creep Show. Well, that's not a show that I want to see, but... All right. <laughs> You're on thin ice, Buster. This is Raymani's snow tile set. Hmm. Wait a second, wait. 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 Oof. What was that? What is that? What is that? It's thin ice, but wh That's not a trap. Is that just like a generic object that you can actually have it... What... That is the craziest and coolest thing I've ever seen in Lemmings. What? I didn't know you could do that! That's not a trap, but you can still have it play in animation? I've literally never seen that before. Okay. Literally, it might be this easy. It seriously might be this easy. Now we just mine through the tree. I said we just mine through the tree. Um, okay. Back root, back root. Back root, back root. <laughs> yeah! Choo choo! Well, yeah, that was definitely a back route. Not only did we not use all the skills, we also didn't pick up any of the pickup skills, and we saved an extra lemming. Oh, wow, exactly one minute, 11 seconds. That's cool. All right, well, I'll take it. We start the level off with a back route. That thin ice is still one of the coolest things I've seen in Lemmings. I literally didn't... R I think you can make an object that just plays an animation and a sound when you walk into the trigger area. Or, like, when you walk past it, but it's not a trap or anything. But, like, I've literally never seen anyone use that before. That's so cool! Literally, level 7, Kitty Compression by Billy Sheehan. Okay, I'm... Is this supposed to be an itty compression? Aw, kitties. I like the cat traps. Uh, we can kill up to five lemmings. Ooh, we got a tight time limit on this one. My its. What? You mean my kitties. I don't I don't know what that's saying. Why are these arrows... The arrows are pointing to the left, but they're moving to the right. And these arrows are pointing to the right, but they're moving to the... Or they're pointing to the left, but moving to the right. And then vice versa. I hate that. Wait, those look, wait, these look like they're pointing to the right, but they're actually pointing to the left. That's even more confusing. That's even more confusing. Okay. Hmm. Oh, wait. Okay, okay. If this is how it's... If this is gonna go how I think it's gonna go, then this is one of the coolest things ever. Alright. Out of it. Well, first off... One of the few times buffering skills can actually be useful. All right. There we go.
How many cats are there? There's five. That's what I was afraid of. Hmm. Yeah, that's a problem. Because we can only let five lemmings die, and we gotta get them all compressed in that one area, and this guy is gonna suck. Okay. Maybe, maybe I'm doing it wrong. Perhaps? No. That's what we gotta do. That's what we gotta do. Alright. Now, hopefully, they're still all crammed together. Nope. Okay. That's, that's totally what we gotta do, though. Alright, so we gotta wait a little bit. Let's start bashing here. There we go. Okay. There we go. Oh, that's cool. All right. Bruh. Please don't kill more than one. All right, here we go. Ha-ha! <laughs> oh, that's a fun level. That's really good. I like that. Kitties make any level better. I also like the 1 minute 30 second time limit. It's very tight, but it's very fair. I, li I like that. You gotta, you gotta go fast. Sometimes you gotta go fast, you know? That's a part of what I means, too. It's not just figuring out the solution. Sometimes you gotta go fast, you know? That was fun. Level 8, Eco Chambers. Oh yeah, I forgot that I'm supposed to guess what these um, are, what these levels are modeled after. Okay. Um, Stacks and Stones is Namita. And then Kitty Compression is uh, Nessie. There. Eco Chambers. This one's got to be in... Well, I mean... It's in the name. It's probably going to be Eco Tolot. Even though this, again, looks like a disjoint union. Are you literally just doing that to troll Eco, Strato? Got 100 means We can kill up to 5 of them. That's a lot of teleporters. Not really a fan of teleporters, but we're going to make do. Hey, at least I made them interact with each other. This is the second Eco Tolot style disjoint union levels that you made. Also, I, you know, I don't... I like it, disjoint unions, so this is great. Disarmor's on that one. Swimmer's on that one. Okay. Interesting. Let's see what, Oh. Where's the exit? Oh, the exit's there. Do they all have to go to this part? Interesting. Well, we got unlimited time, and these guys aren't going anywhere. Those guys- actually, I don't think any of them are going anywhere. Alright, if that's the case, let's start with the fire guys. Actually, no, we should start with the disarmers. No, we can't start with the disarmers. Alright. Okay. Yeah. We'll start with these guys. Do that, and then walk. Again, I don't like how long the teleporters take. Anyhow, now we're gonna bash them out. We're gonna make. F Wait, no. We've got walkers. You know, those skills that exist. Now, is there a way to do this such that it'll be a disarmor that goes through first?
No? Alright. Well then, if that's the case, we're gonna make two of them walk. Or we're gonna make two of them climb. One of them will go ahead, and the other will turn around and bash them out. Because we want this guy to disarm this trap. Alright. I'm thinking this... Okay. That teleporter is only for swimmers. Nope. That's the problem. Where does that teleporter lead? I can't tell. What? Regardless, though, these guys are going to be the ones we uh, deal with next. Alright, where are you... Okay, Swimmer comes from there. Of course he does. If he does that, we can mine his bridge so nobody follows. Hmm. That is a pickle. I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to get them out from here. Only way I can think of is with miners. I'm sorry, how did you get up here? Oh, did I mine? Dug on it. Alright, we'll mine farther up the bridge. There, are you happy? <laughs> no one follow us. <laughs> Can you get up there without a clone? No, you can't. Dog on it. Alright. I'm not exactly sure how to get them all up through this with this giant body of water in the way. I think we're gonna have to go under. No, we're not! We don't necessarily have to go under. If we can go over. Of course, that's still going to be a bit problematic, I think. We can have a stoner do his fan to turn them around. But we are running very low on builders, which is not good. All right, you climb up for all this. And all of this so we can stone. Kidding me? They didn't fix the bridge? Okay. Alright. Now we have the highly irritating task of getting these guys up. Which I think might involve precision stoning. Oh, so close! Oh my gosh, really? Well, unfortunately, that's still not 
still not out of the woods by doing that. Here's an idea. I don't know if it's a good one. But we do have free stoners left. Well, maybe only two. Gonna get up that second one right there. Doggone it, are you for real? Alright, this is a bit too much of a mess. Going under is gonna be too costly as well in the skill department. That actually worked out kind of great. Alright. Now, maybe we can mine... Like that. Aha! Yes! I am liking this. And now... Bash or er, bash mine and walk at the right point. Nope, that's too much. Okay. No, that's not gonna work. We have to expend a builder. Loath as I am to do it, this is much less costly than it was in the past. Alright. waiting for all of the... I don't like waiting for all the teleporters to go off, but, you know, sometimes we have to do things we'd rather not do, but must. Alright, you're a sw Oh, we got a lot of swimmers. Now, unfortunately, we gotta figure... We gotta make sure they're only gonna go into this from the left. If they go to the other side, that's going to be a bit of... Nope, we have enough builders to stop them. Uh -huh, big brain time. Alright, now at this point, I think that's everything. Now it's just a very long wait. Wait, did I hear drowning? No, I did not. Wait, where are the... I have to save an extra 13? Where did they all die? I am confused. Where did they die?
I'm sorry, why did you drown there? Seriously, if they're going to the left, they drown for literally no reason. That's very stupid. So literally, I have to make another stoner. Just... That's so stupid. I know it didn't really affect the solution all, but like... That is really stupid. That is colossally stupid, and also, that puts me one lemming short. So we literally will just have to find a way to avoid putting them in that. Okay. No, you know what? You know what? This will work. You can walk. We have one climber left. Let's do this. Alright. So we'll get to a point like this. Alright. Now, nope, we bash through this. And now, if we mine... No, I did not hit the reset button. That is bogus. All right, going back to here. If we might, we want to mine in such a way. Yes. Now, if they bypass this, they will not go in from the left. Again, one of the reasons I really don't like teleporters. Not a huge fan of that level. Not because it's a disjoint union, but because I don't like the way these teleporters are behaving. I also don't like. I don't like the way the water was behaving either. But if um, if my calculations are correct, that will give us save help us to save exactly enough. Yeah, look at that. That could, that took 17 in-game minutes. Like really? <laughs> the, and it wasn't that big of a level. If it takes 17 minutes and the level can almost fit on one screen, you might be doing something wrong. Just just saying. Maybe maybe use my Lego teleporters, which are a lot faster. <laughs> Maybe make it so the teleporters don't um, put them in the water for literally no reason if they walk out the wrong, uh, to the left. Level 9. Run. Run. Well, I mean, you said it, so okay. This is by Depeche Mode. I don't know. Three minute time limit. 40 lemmings, we got to save them all. <laughs> What's with the steel pillar in the middle there? <laughs> Run. All right. Um, why? Why do we have to save everybody? Why do we have to save everybody? Oh, I don't like this already. Why do we have to save everybody? Why do we have to save everybody? Well, gonna have to undercut the blocker at some point in the level then. There's not even any cloners. Okay, thank goodness that works. Alright. You're gonna dig. You are going to dig. That's a thing. It's gonna happen. Okay. I'm gonna treat this as an unlimited amount of builders. You know how I'd be. Alright. Yeah. Simple builder into the wall should cut their fall. Hey, that rhymed. 
Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to cut off the sound effects. How are you going to turn them all around, though? Oh, I know. I know how you do it. Okay. So now we're going to undercut the blockers. Both of them. Alright, now we're going to build up here. Perhaps we need to build up a little higher. This is where the platformer comes in handy. Now we do this. Okay. This is great. So now he's gonna hit this. Now he's gonna dig. And now he's gonna mine to free him. And now we've got two extra climbers. And they can climb up through here. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's such a good level. Oh, that is such a good level. I love that. <laughs> it's funny that the level is called Rome because actually I think that level was very right. That was such a good level. Oh, man. That was so clever, but also like really, really, really fun. Oh, thank goodness. All right, we're going to try for one more level today. Level 10, Read My Lips by SCB. Well, this is definitely a Flopsy level. SCB are like not really his initials, but... He made a pack called Seblem, so, you know, it's going to be pretty obvious. Also, just want to point out that on the left side of the screen, underneath the S, it looks like somebody's pursing their lips with their teeth, like, <laughs> Ugh. Looks kind of weird. 40 lemons, we can kill two of them. Oh, I bet that's that's probably intentional, because the level's called Read My Lips. If so, that's amazingly clever. I love it. All right. Hey, Flopsy, you forgot about this one. <laughs> I didn't forget about it. I'm sure that's what he would say. Just didn't put it in his pack. Okay, we got some pickups, pickups. Everybody got pickups. Well, maybe, maybe I can avoid them. Oh, we basically have unlimited builders. This is great. Okay. Are there just the two hatches? Sweet. I dig it. Aw, oh, come on, mate. Don't do that. All right. Is the glider really going to be all that useful? I'm trying to think. I don't see the glider being all that useful. The blocker will be. Oh, maybe... Wait, we can... I'm confused. I'm very confused. Okay, you guys can do that. Now on this side, we're going to make a digger holding pit. Like so. And now we're going to try to do the same thing on this side. Oh, wow. We don't actually have one lemming go past. That's actually a bit of an issue.
There we go. Everyone's getting held back. Not in school, just in life. Actually, that's not better. And now it's just going to be multitasking between these two sides. Actually, I'm just going to build there and then wait for this guy to come around. I know that they want us to climb and glide up there, but no, forget that. I've got unlimited. <laughs> I've got unlimited bat uh, builders. Well, almost unlimited builders. Watch me run out of builders. Actually, I'm almost certain we're gonna run out of builders. I'm already predicting it. It's gonna happen. I'm not giving you an arty guarantee, but it's it's gonna happen. Oh, thank you, big builder pickup. Alright, I think I'm going to dig a little bit at the end here. Oh, beautiful! Look at that. That's great. Now, before we actually go get carried away there, we're going to use our remaining builders. Doop! And doop! Now we can bash through here. Yeah, like, most of these pickups we do not need. I don't know if they're red herrings or if this is just the Omega back route, but I'm assuming we don't need them. Boom, 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 boom. Everybody go to the exit. That was a fun level. I like that one. I, again, I like most levels. Artie's not really that hard of a critic for the most part. But I like the architecture for that level, and it was it, that's one of those just, you got a bunch of skills, use them to your advantage, be efficient, and you can get to the exit no problem. Yeah, I ignored, like, I think I ignored just about every single pickup skill, and we saved two extra lemmings and had a bunch of skills left over. Yeah! I mean, I, that feels like it's a fairly open-ended level, but I'm not sure why you put all those pickup skills in if you don't, if you really just don't need them. So, maybe Strata will leave me a comment regarding that. Anyhow... We also went through five levels today, which is great. We're on the five-level track. That's probably going to change next episode, though. Anyhow, in the meantime, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I'm Colorful Artie, and I hope you tune in next time. We are now on level 11, and hopefully we can knock out the next five levels again. And th uh, this rank is just gradually coming to a close. So, until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.